Right now, nearly a year after former North End restaurant owner was arrested and charged with shooting at a man near a popular bakery, Patrick Mendoza is back in police custody. He was arrested over the weekend and accused of cutting a GPS monitoring device off his ankle. NBC 10's Mary Marcos is live outside Suffolk Superior Court. So, Mary, what happened today? Well, Patrick Mendoza is being held without bail at least until tomorrow, and police say he wasn't shy about why he decided to cut off that ankle bracelet in the first place. A North End restaurateur back in court for cutting off his GPS monitor. Strap alerts um, occurred on Saturday, June 8, 2024, uh, where he went unmonitored from approximately 9.32 p.m. Um, until now. Here's Patrick Mendoza at a previous court appearance. He's charged with shooting at a man he'd feuded with for years last summer. Now he's facing a probation violation. Mr. Mendoza was arrested over the weekend after cutting off the GPS that this court uh, fit to him roughly two or three weeks ago. Mendoza had been wearing the anklet since posting $10,000 cash bail in May. Boston police arresting him for cutting it off around 10.15 Saturday night at this North End apartment. I made some concerning statements to Boston police when he was taken into custody as well. When police asked why he cut off the monitoring device, he said he was, quote, tired and sick of it, according to the police report. Then during the booking process, Mendoza allegedly said he was, quote, definitely going to kill somebody. I'm going to hold you without bail until tomorrow afternoon, and we're going to have a full hearing on whether or not your bail should be revoked uh, for 89 more days after that. The police report from this weekend also saying Mendoza had been going through it and behaving erratically recently because he was, quote, extremely stressed about the criminal case pending against him. Now, Mendoza is due back here at Suffolk Superior Court tomorrow afternoon. That's when they'll decide whether or not to keep him behind bars for 90 days. Now, his lawyer did not respond to our request for comment. Live in Boston, Mary Marcos, NBC 10 Boston.